Rhymebill is now online. Hey guys and girls, today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a loading screen in HTML. To start things off, we're going to open a simple HTML tag, and inside a HTML tag, we're also going to open a body tag. Following that, we're going to make an optional title, which is going to be called loading. Next up, we're going to open a div, which is going to contain our spinny circle. And that's it. We're going to move on to the style because that's going to be the majority of this video. It's just adding animations to the spin wheel stuff. We're going to start off easy by changing the background color from white to somewhat like a red. Now that that's done, now we can change our title. This is optional. I'm thinking of changing the color, font face, and alignment. And last but not least, the spinny thingy. So here, we're gonna change up the look of it and we're gonna add an animation, which is gonna be pretty cool in the end. And also, feel free to customize any of these settings. It's not like I'm a professional or anything. Finally, the animation. First things first, if you're gonna do this on Internet Explorer and not Google Chrome, change your mind right now, because it's not gonna work on Explorer if you do it my way. So the animation is pretty simple. At keyframe zero, it's not gonna turn, but at keyframe, let's say 100, then it's gonna turn 360 degrees, and it's gonna keep doing this over and over again. And that's how we have our loading spinny thingy. And finally, as a good coder, you want to save. So let's go ahead and open it up and see our loadings. Oh my gosh, it looks good, but why isn't it working? And first of all, I thought I changed my text to white. Why is loading black? Ha ha ha, oh my gosh, I spelled it wrong. And I forgot to add a colon after transform. Oh my gosh, it actually works. And there you have it. That's how to make a loading screen using HTML. And until next time, Rhyme Bill out.